I had songs, you know, I, I had songs that I used to sing in, in my iPhone, in my car, in my house from years ago. And I always wanted to use these songs, but I just never knew how. You know, I got the idea from Ephesians 4. The writer talks about being a prisoner of Christ, but for me, the idea comes from um, being, I, growing up in church, I see people addicted to, or prisoners, I'll say, emotionalism. Uh, prisoners to just certain things that, I just call it, I just call it, you know, I would just say just bondage. You know, I want to be free. I want to, I want to experience God in a new way. And I don't want to be there. I want to be emotional, but I want to be attached to Him in a sense. When I get in contact with God, there's peace, there's healing, you know, there's deliverance. Who wouldn't want to be a prisoner to that? When every day we're deceived, some prophets have stuff up under their sleeves. Their sleeves, yeah, yeah. To them, I never be a prisoner. Oh no, no, no. But to the one that this is where I grew up at. This is the church that I, that my grandfather and my grandmother started. Everything I know musically, everything I know spiritually, uh, came from this church. Uh, from playing to singing, everything came from here. I'm grateful for my roots. Bishop Kipton, Pastor Sarah Kipton. I love them. And uh, they didn't have to take me in. They didn't have to have me, you know, at their church. But they made me go to church, you know, every Sunday. Anybody that's a church kid knows. So you gotta be there every Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and Friday, and Saturday, all that. Oh.